Kim Brinson, stage name Doc Keller. I served 26 years in the United States Army. Two combat tours, one during Desert Storm, 1990 and 91, Saudi Arabia, and one combat tour in Afghanistan, Enduring Freedom. I was privileged to go twice under both President Bush's and bring home all of my people during both occasions. Um, that's not an easy task within itself. It's not an easy task because I know a whole lot of people that just didn't make it back. And first of all, I'd like to thank everybody that's ever put on that uniform and served. Those who came before me and those who come behind me because we are like 1% of the people. And coming home from Afghanistan, well actually from Desert Storm, I started to write a song. The name of that song is Post Traumatic Stress. Basically, it was what I was going through coming home, and I realized that it was going to be my form of healing. I thought the song was finished in 1991, and then I got deployed to Afghanistan in 2002 behind the towers going down in New York. And not until I came home did I realize that that story wasn't complete yet. In fact, I wrote the second verse 12 years later, and now it's serving as, uh, I don't know, maybe a healing to a lot of people that hear it behind me. I put out an album called Lessons in Life. If you look to your rear, there's a poster right there with myself on it. And I have four songs that are on my album that are dedicated specifically to military personnel and family members that put on that uniform. That was my way of saying thank you to everyone because during, after my second tour, I sent more soldiers over. But beforehand, my mother, who is deceased now, asked me if I would get out of the military. And I told her I couldn't. And she wanted to know why. And I told her, my soldiers are to me like us, your children are to you. And if I got out today, and something happened to one of those soldiers, I would have to live with that for the rest of my life. So she was in the hospital, and I promised her that after I trained up my last group, I would leave the military. Unfortunately, she, <clears throat> she passed before that happened. However, when I got through training up that last group, who are now leaders, I did retire and fulfill my promise. And one of the songs on that uh, CD is Leaders. Another one is I Salute, which myself and my Marine, my Marine brother, Daryl Cook, will be performing today. There's a third song called Weekend Pass, and the very last song on the album is called Post Traumatic Stress. It's not just my story. Everybody that's put on that uniform served in any capacity is part of their story too. And I felt a need to put it out there like it is. There is absolutely no profanity on my CD because I needed for everybody to be able to listen to it, for everybody to be able to enjoy it, and for everybody to stop at some point and say what many of the speakers before me said. Thank you, I salute.